In this video, I'm going to show you how you can show buttons on copied sheets in Excel. So here I have a schedule and I have a button here saying the next four weeks. So basically what it's going to do is it's going to uh, start from the end of day here and give me a schedule for the next four weeks. So I'm going to click this button and there comes up my schedule. But we have two buttons on here and I don't know if you've ever tried to copy uh, things with buttons, but they just don't work. So let me show you how I did this. So the template that I'm copying from one sheet to the other is this sheet form. And you notice it does not have buttons on it. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to select the whole sheet. So I'm going up here and I'm going control C to copy it. And I'm going to put in a new worksheet and I'm going to go control V to paste it. And so now there, that, there's a wonderful little trick in the world of macros where you can record a macro. And so what I'm going to do, and I'm going to the record macro button here, and it's asking me to name it. So I'm going to um, call it test button. Okay. And so now what it's going to do is we're going to record the actions that I'm doing. So what I'm doing is I'm going to this toolbox here. I'm clicking on it. I'm selecting the button on the top here. And then I'm going right there and I'm going to put my button in here. Now, the first thing it does it is it asks you what you're going to um, link to this button. And so I'm linking that call every four weeks. That's the program that I'm linking to it. And now what I'm going to do is I am going to um, delete this. And then I'm going to type in next four weeks. And then I'm going to hit the square button on the bottom to end my um, to end my macro. And so now if we go to our developer tab and we go to um, macros, we can see that we have the test button here. And if we step into it, you can see that all the code is made for you for all of these. So in my original um, original macro, my original macro is every four weeks. And then uh, it just basically um, creates a new sheet. And then uh, then it copies my, my form onto the new sheet and then um, adds it to it. But to make the buttons paint, basically what I do is I simply call the buttons, the make button and call schedule button, which is a two button macros that I've recorded. And it works perfectly. I will, of course, include the code for the every four weeks in the video. Um, you will have to record your own button macros to get this to work. Please subscribe.